This is Shadow Warrior 2. We're here on Xbox Series X. Be sure to like the video. Subscribing is great as well. It's the second entry in this offbeat first person shooter following the misadventures of former corporate shogun Le Wang. He's a reclusive mercenary. And we're ready to get into the action. So, your formidable warrior, use a combination of guns, blades, magic, other stuff like that to blast people. And uh, you can battle alone or with up to four players online and in co-op, which is kind of cool. And uh, yeah, use just a range of weapons to absolutely dominate and uh, you know, decimate your opponents and stuff like that, which is kind of fun. It's a bit of a quirky series in terms of being ridiculous and action-packed. I think after I've done this one, I've essentially covered uh, the whole series now, so that's kind of exciting. Uh, Gameplay-wise, obviously the third one was sort of my, I think, entry point, and then I did the first one, and now I'm finally taking a look at the second one, which is kind of exciting. Uh, they're kind of similar in terms of, like, movement and style, and, uh, yeah, they're just kind of, like, action-packed, running through, shooting, blasting, destroying stuff, and, uh, pretty straightforward games, which, uh, works well. Dude, <laughs> don't take damage from falling. Yeah, it's just, it's supposed to be pretty crazy action, is, is what this is, and they just kind of have fun with it, and it's, it's just, like, ridiculous narrative, and crazy characters, and just wild action and stuff, and it actually has, like, a pretty extensive lore, too, which is kind of cool if you're into this type of thing. Like, I don't know, it's, it's extensive, right? There's all kinds of weird mystical stuff going on, it, it gets pretty crazy. And the lead character kind of entertaining in a very strange, bizarre sort of way as well. So uh, here on the Series X, it's 900p, which is a bit rough visually for sure. It's pretty low uh, resolution. But we do have the benefit of FPS boost, which means it's uh, 60 FPS, which is a fantastic feeling for a shooter game. And it's nice to actually run into another game that is FPS boosted that I hadn't taken a look at prior. Auto HDR. And, uh, yeah. Oh, come on. Always doing stuff like that. Well, that's a problem. Temple Guardian, more like a dead guardian, am I right? So yeah, you have a wide range of weapons to use, and you'll get uh, more weapons and tools as you continue to kill enemies and progress and go back at it and play it over again and stuff. And, yeah, kind of a fun, easy-going experience. And also part of why I wanted to jump in and take a look at this, because I was like, oh, you know, I I don't know if I necessarily seen it prior, like, uh, as available as it was, and I was like, alright. It's also neat because, like, to a degree, the games are also kind of different evolutions of one another. It's a lot of foes. <laughs> oh, you run across that and take the bridge out, eh? Bye bye. All in a day's work. This game is so ridiculous. It's actually probably a pretty good candidate for them to do, like, a remastered trilogy pack someday. I could totally see that being a thing. The Temple of Longing. Like, the Temple of Double Jumping to get on top of things.
Hmm. Yeah, no, it, it is pretty much your typical sort of shooter game. It's just got the elements of weird fantasy, ridiculous combat, uh, zany moves, quirky, funny protagonist character, and just ridiculous action. To a hero landing? Hmm. Guys, you need directions? Just take a sharp left through my sword and keep on going. Do I even need to kill these guys? Making you dead makes me feel so alive. Nice work. You deserve a hand for that. Oh look, here's one someone's not using anymore. I'll grab that chi. Oh, and it loads way faster too, which is kind of nice. Gets you right back into the action. It's like a self-opening door. Haka may be a cold-blooded sociopathic mob boss, but she knows how to decorate. Yeah, she does. Hello there. Hello. Hello. Jesus, this a party, or was there a toxic spill? Perhaps you will realize her destiny one day. Fascinating. Oh, you'll get your chance. I see. There has been an incident, Mr. Wang. Smith, what are you doing here? You work for this beep. Nice lady, too? I am in no one's employ but my own. You two know each other? Smith is my mechanic. Fixed my car a few dozen times. <laughs> I am here on personal business. Kamiko has gone missing. The birthday girl. Does that mean no cake? It's gonna mean no balls for you if you don't shut your yammering mouth. Oh, I see what's going on. The big boss's daughter got lost on your watch. Do I smell a beheading? More importantly, do you think they'll sell tickets? I'm afraid the situation is quite serious. For some time, she's been worried that Zilla has found her out. And today, she was due at my garage at four. She is never late. <laughs> whoa, 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 rewind. Zilla? Orochi Zilla? Yes. She was working in his labs, undercover. Oh, he doesn't like that kind of thing. I'm organizing a rescue mission. Zilla's security is legendary. They wouldn't get past the front desk. And what would you suggest? Go in quiet. You send one guy, preferably one that knows his way around. Are you offering your services? Depends on what you're paying. 100,000, cash. Ah, that should please my accountant. I still have a few old badges and a couple fakes. I can get in and at least tell you what you're dealing with. Go then, find out what happened. Bring her back if you can. Back here? No. This is the first place they'll look. Take her to... I have a secluded location you may use. Okay then, take her to the old man's place. Bring her to my garage, I'll meet you there. What do you want me to do with this? I can give it to her, when I see her. Lo Wang? Yes. Don't fuck this up. <laughs> if she dies, they'll be picking your fingertips out of my gardens for weeks. Lady Shun is such low resolution quality assets for these characters. <laughs> the fearful heart. Hey, beats being the fool of the tearful fart. That's deeply stupid. That's true. Fair That's enough. Deeply. Get out of here! <laughs> That's deeply stupid. <laughs> so the way you delivered that line killed me. I have a skill point. Nice. All right, I feel slightly more powerful. Let's do it. I feel like a goddamn babysitter. But you know what? Babysitters make good money. They actually do. They actually do. Well, 
Welcome to the shiny. Well, this is cool looking. Hey, one out of three ain't bad. It's just so hard to find a good forger these days. Note to self kill your fucking forger. I love the fast paced and ridiculous over the top combat. You know, this would actually look really good with a, uh, a remastered effort, eh? What kind of like floating weird city is this? This is such a different set of locations from the third one. This is hilarious. Hmm. Did you imagine playing this and it wasn't FPS boosted? You guys dead? The future just keeps getting futurier. The future just keeps getting futurier. <sighs> Room's locked. Bulletproof glass, too. I wonder if that's. Oh, Kamiko. My star pupil. Yeah, of course it's her. Come now, come now, calm yourself, my dear. Let you go? I'm afraid I can't do that, my dearest. It would spoil our grand experiment, and you always loved experiments. Before we embark on this grand adventure, there's something I should say. Those look like very large I am needles. Deeply in your debt, young lady. I would never have achieved all that I have without your help. The lab just won't be the same without you to steal from. <coughs> Proceed. Uh oh. Godzilla. I knew you were into some twisted shit. This is on a whole other level. That's He's not gonna try to stop this. What's happening? Is she all right? Someone check her vitals. Pulse is normal, sir. Untie her gag. I don't want her suffocating. We need her to be. Flies carry on the stench of death. Oh, that doesn't look good. Now this is getting interesting. Oh shit. Bulldoze bodies. Open sores. Dismember children. Secure the room. I need to examine her in person. I'm on my way. Yes, sir. Hey, you guys know a good Mexican place around here? What? Get him! You guys know a good Mexican <laughs> What? <laughs> You guys know a good Mexican place around here. Goodbye. Do you know a good Mexican? What is? <sighs> You supposed to kill all of them? Mm. 
Does this count as a henchman even though it's a robot sphere? And I thought that thing was dead, gonna be honest with you. I just wish this wasn't so murky. It actually looks like it'd be a very clean visual aesthetic. Oh, hello, no ammo friends. You ready to kill some people? Did I grab the access card or is it all the way back there? Did I miss the access card? Do I have to backtrack? Ooh, refreshing. I found the essence of Eagle. Kaka! Eagly? There's something running with FPS boosts, it is strangely slow feeling. And despite all of its abilities too, which is very fascinating. These orbs, uh, they, they take a lot of damage, eh? Oh, he's a lieutenant. Hello there. One, two, three, five. Doesn't look too good. Thirteen, twenty. Hey, spooky number lady. I'm gonna get you out of here. I just need you to. I am the graveyard of hope. I am the end of all times. I am the shadow of the world. In Dok Boshina. God damn, girl. Do what thou wilt shall be the whole of the law. I am the filth under your nails. I am the oil that stains your soul. I am despair made manifest. Okay, so this is probably a terrible idea, but I'm sort of out of options here. Uh, I I'm gonna untie you. When I do, please don't eat my face. <laughs> okay? Friend. <laughs> All right, here we go. Anyone please don't eat my face. You? Put that one in the plus column. Up you go. Come on. Take it easy there. You're doing really well with the non-face eating. Now, <laughs> the emergency exit. Fuck, Zilla. This place is a fire hazard if I've ever seen... Oh, <laughs> this place is a fire no, hazard please. if I've ever seen one. What's that? Oh, you're trapped in a glass box? Oh, that's good. How many years did you spend in mine school? <laughs> Listen, I would love to stay and catch up, but I've got this possessed girl and she's... You see what I mean? <laughs> <laughs> 